What we're going to do right now is give the awards for the people that won our festival. And how it works is we have about 50 people rate every movie. The ones that get rated the highest, we then send to judges around the country. We have 18 judges. If you look in your program, you can see who they are. We do not judge the festival ourselves. We have outside judges. All the winners from last year get a judge and different professors. So there's a lot of people that judge. I am pleased to present the award for best student film, which is going to The Treehouse, which was directed by A.J. Sheeran and Sam Shapson. Yes, we read a, a three final screenplays at our table read today at the museum, and the winner is The Uterus Chat, writer Melody Wilderman. It's my second year here, and we made amazing friends here last year, and this year there's even more, and uh, I just, I wanna thank Lance and his whole staff, and um, my family and friends who came. Thank you guys so much, and uh, I wanna thank my husband, because um, he won this last year, which is crazy, because yeah, he won this last year, and um, he forgot to thank me, so I'm gonna thank him a lot. <laughs> like, profusely thank him. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Thanks. All right, tonight for our best narrative short, we have a Black Metal, uh, directed by Kat Candler. Uh, for best uh, documentary short, we have uh, This Is Normal, directed by Derek Watson. Thank you, guys. Uh, I'd like to thank uh, a lot of different people. One thing, my wife, my beautiful wife, who lets me travel around the world and shoot films, and um, she's pregnant with twins, and, and she's an amazing woman. And so everybody give her a round of applause because she's the real secret to less success. Um, and uh, Water 4, the, the organization this film is about, if you didn't get to see This Is Normal, is about an, organi an organization that is seriously about a mile and a half down the road that is changing uh, the face of the water crisis around the world. and. Uh, and uh, it's Okies doing it, which is pretty crazy. And so every, most people don't know, but every 21 seconds a child dies because of the water that they drink. And Water 4 is taking care of that. And it's Oklahomans that are doing it, which is pretty cool. So um, anyway, thank you so much, Sarah. This is awesome. Appreciate it. Hi, everyone. My name is Leslie Channel. I'm the deputy director of the Oklahoma Film and Music Office. And we're so excited to be sponsoring the festival again this year. And we're particularly excited to be giving an award to Oklahoma filmmakers. That's near and dear to our heart. The first award we'd like to give is for the best Oki short. This year goes to Sherman and Pacifico, directed by Daniel Tarr. Thank you guys very much. I, I, I want to thank uh, first uh, Al Nove, the wind beneath my wings, who's currently housing me right now. Um, and Don Suenos, who helped edit the film, and everyone who worked on it, and especially uh, this goes out to Mark Sherman, who uh, the film is dedicated to, and who is also uh, one of the lead actors in the film, who uh, who passed away. But this goes out to Mark. Uh, Mark, love you very much, man, and very happy to support and support Oklahoma too. Thank you. Okay, next up is the award for best Oki feature, and it goes to Home James, yeah! director Jonathan Rossetti. Thank you very much. We're so thrilled to be a part of this wonderful film festival, and uh, and we really appreciate uh, this and and, uh, and celebrating Oklahoma with our little Oki film. I co-wrote this film uh, with Julie Gearhart, who's also an Oki, and, and it wouldn't be right to not let her say something. Yeah, thank you all. This is such an honor, such an honor to have a world premiere in Oklahoma, and uh, thank you to my parents. This movie wouldn't have been possible without you. I want to thank George Sue, the cinematographer who couldn't have been here. He was amazing. Thank you to Colin and Chad and Todd and Alex, Alex who has <laughs> put up with a lot for the, this movie. So thank you all so much. Thank you. We are so honored that Lance asked us to present a very, very special award tonight, one that's super near and dear to our hearts. It's being presented to someone who knew that Death Center was ready to move forward before we even knew it was ready to move forward. We literally ran these things out of our car for uh, a couple of years, and the time came when we needed an employee. Like a real employee, someone who actually answers the phone and answers an email. And so we had a conversation to where we agreed that we were going to bring this gorgeous creature on board the Death Center ship, and we promised that we would always pay her. Always. Yeah. And since that time, that dream has grown and grown and grown, as you guys see tonight. This person is the reason why we have great volunteers. Indeed. 
This person is the reason emails get answered. This person is the re oh yeah, indeed. Indeed, and if you've ever been a filmmaker at another festival and never had an email returned, you know how vitally important that little streamline of communication is. And she has made this festival so streamlined and so lovely, and she handles everything with grace and gratitude. Because if you ask her for help, if she needs help, she goes, no, no, I'm fine, it's fine. No, it's fine. Wait, what can I do for you, Mama? Hey, how can I help you? That's who this person is. And those people do not come along every once in a while. Sometimes they come around every decade. Every decade. Every decade. So tonight, we're gonna honor a person that's been with Dead Center for a decade. She is the third spoke on the Muse wheel. <laughs> She is Kim Haywood! Oh, look, look at this beautiful oh, award she is. that has your name. I think it says a decade of commish. Yeah! These two, they're like, we just want to sit in here back, back here with you and just hang out. Okay, cool. Thank you. Um, Someone asked me earlier if I thought 10 years ago that I would still be here, and I don't think I really thought about that, but what I really didn't realize is that 10 years from then that I'd be still be doing my dream job. So um, thank you guys. Thanks, Melissa and Khaki, because truly, truly, you've taught me everything I know. Oh. True story. Oh, it's true. Um, but also, this is great, but also we have an amazing team, Kevin Ely, Sarah McCombs, Brian Hearn, Alex McCart, Ian Peterson, Lance McDaniel. These kids work their rears off um, throughout the year to help us program this festival. And we literally have 300 volunteers that are working the, these five days to make this event happen. And they work like around the year to make this happen. So please give them a round of applause because they really, really deserve it. We can't do this by ourselves. And again, let's just get one loud round of applause for Kim Haywood, please. Thank you. Thank you, Lance. It's my pleasure to give the uh, special jury prize for short film, and that goes to Running Deer and Brent Ryan Green, director. Very talented director. Yeah, just a uh, big thanks to Dead Center and everyone who puts this together. Dead Center's uh, been a home for my films. This is my fifth film to have in the festival, and um, so it's just a uh, real big thanks to everyone who puts this on. Um, and then Running Deer is uh, playing tomorrow. Harkins at five, if you want to see it. And uh, then a, a special thanks to my mother, my wife, who are here with me. So. Hi, I'm Kevin Ely. I'm the features programmer uh, for the Dead Center Film Festival. Um, I get to give the award for the special jury award for uh, feature. These the special jury awards are the only awards that are selected by the Dead Center staff, and um, we are very pleased and honored to present um, this award to Worm. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Dead Center. Um, we wish that uh, Andrew Bowser, the writer, director, producer, star of the film, could be here tonight. I know that uh, he is awaiting our text uh, to find out what happened, um, but I know that he is going to be ecstatic that we won. Um, and thank you everybody who voted. Thank you uh, to all the cast, um, to our family and friends um, for all your support. And uh, here's Ian, I'm sure he has a couple more things to say. I just want to thank everybody for this. I want to thank Dead Center for having us and giving us this award. It's awesome. I, I do have a message from Andrew. He says, uh, I want to thank everyone in Oklahoma for their talent and support while making Worm. We could have not pulled this off, could have not pulled off such a crazy idea without the hospitality and grace from the people of Guthrie and surrounding cities. Thank you to Damon Devereaux for your constant trust and assistance, and David and Myra for your home-cooked meals and warm beds. Also, thank you to the cast and crew for aligning your talents with an idea as insane as ours was. We couldn't have done it without you, Andrew. So thank you very much. So the final two awards of this evening, uh, the first one is Grand Jury Doc. And first of all, um, I just want to say that when we, when we go into programming and when we're doing this, we're looking for unique voices and we're looking for things that we think that you guys want to see and that you'd be proud of. So um, these are two amazing films and we're proud to, brought, uh, to bring them to you. Um, and the Grand Jury Doc winner is Out of Print. And I don't think you're here for that. But congratulations, I'll take your award home. 
And the last award is Grand Jury Feature, and that goes to The Spectacular Now. Well, thanks to the Dead Center Film Festival and thanks to the judges, uh, I need to acknowledge the producers, Tom McNulty and Andrew Lauren, for making sure the, the this picture got made. Also, the uh, screenwriters, Scott Neustetter, Michael Weber, for bringing my words onto the silver screen. And also to Shailene Woodley and Miles Teller for their fantastic portrayals of the two main characters. Thank you very much.